everyone, it's Bob and Fran, and we want to share with you today uh, a list of some of the things that we have been doing over the years to stay young in body, mind, and spirit. People have asked us to share this list, and so we'll present some of the things that we do on a daily basis. I want to talk to you about a weekly cleanse that we do every Tuesday. You can pick any day <laughs> of the week, but on Tuesdays, of course, we stay whole food plant-based, but what we eliminate is all the grains that we may eat. So no rice, no uh, pastas of any kind, but no just bread. ma no breads, mainly fruits and vegetables. And so a typical breakfast would be for us would be uh, just a bowl of fresh fruit and maybe uh, a few nuts with that and uh, I well, guess uh, you know, lunch would be a salad. Yeah, and oftentimes dinner would be a bowl of vegetable soup. Maybe and a, a salad baked, or a baked, baked potato, potato is yeah. good. Yeah. and uh, boy, I tell you, it's a great way to control your weight. It makes you feel good, and uh, we strongly advise you to give it a try. So once a week. I want to talk about meditation? I do. Okay. I think meditation is uh, a practice. For being a mindful person. A mindful person is a person that does his or hers best to be in the moment at all times, to be present as we say. And that means it keeps your mind from wandering into the past where you may be upset or angry at something or your mind wandering into the future where maybe you're fearful of something or you're worried about something. Both the past and the future are really stressors for you. So if you meditate, maybe just for five to 10 minutes, a couple times a day, just sitting quietly in a quiet place, again, no electronics, just sit quietly and just watch your breath. Just watch the and feel the breath on the inhalation at the tip of your nostrils there and then the same when you exhale so that type of practice is a great way just to take a break during your day and it will help you focus more on what's going on moment to moment to moment okay now back to a, a little tip that we learned to make our bedroom healthier oh we're going from meditate, <laughs> meditate to mattress, mattress. <laughs> okay um, it's a good idea to get a mattress and pillow cover that is made to protect against dust mites. Now, you don't think about this normally, but there are um, dust mites oftentimes in the mattress and in the pillow. So we got special protective covers for that. And you can shop for that. Yeah, on, online. On, yeah, online. Something to keep in mind. Uh, we have found that it's very important to avoid mm -hmm. casing. Now, you may not know what casein is. It's an ingredient in a lot of dairy products and in some non-dairy products that has been found to be a cancer-causing ingredient. So look for um, products that don't contain casein. So I want to mention one tip that we do quite often, as long as the weather is pretty good, and that's a nice, easy walk after dinner. It seems to just put the food in place, I guess. <laughs> It and helps. Uh, and, and <laughs> we think it's and you it doesn't have to be a fast walk like maybe your morning walk. This is totally different than your morning uh, workout, but it's uh, something that we've gotten in the habit of doing, and it, it just feels really really good. Back to removing chemicals again. Uh, France, I found chemistry it, teacher. <laughs> it's no, she wasn't. <laughs> to use natural makeup, natural hair color, and natural deodorants. I use. <laughs> natural makeup. You definitely natural have natural hair, hair color. color. As you can see, I have natural hair color. <laughs> <Yeah>, okay. <sure. laughs> um, we are absolutely opposed to plastic water bottles. Um, as a matter of fact, you've probably heard that heat um, leaches chemicals out of the plastic into the water. And even if your water that you're buying in a supermarket seems to be chilled, it may have come in a truck that was hot in the sun you know, for hours, sun. right. So, so as a substitute, show them what we use. Yeah, oh yeah. 
So we use now, this is not a commercial. We just happened to find that these are wonderful. Yeah, these are called hydro flax. Flask. Hydro fla <laughs> flask. And they come in a variety of colors. And uh, boy, these things last like a lifetime. I think they're actually guaranteed for. Yeah. Uh, for, As a for matter a of fact, if you put something cold in there, it stays cold for 24 hours. If you put something hot in there, it stays hot for maybe 8 to 12 hours. Good idea. Okay, jumping around. We feel it's important to uh, use as little sugar as possible in your diet. Uh, Bob especially loves stevia in his coffee, and I use some stevia in sweetening um, some desserts that I make, mm -hmm. uh, but we don't use any white refined sugar. So uh, i like to hear from you uh, in the comments section about some of our ideas. I know we'll get some criticism, <laughs> well, you said this or that. But uh, I'm looking for positive comments, or I'd like to know what maybe some of your favorites might be and if you'll implement them in your own life. And if you haven't yet subscribed to our channel, we'd really appreciate that. And we're going to look forward to seeing you again very soon. Thanks very much for coming. Bye-bye.